भगवते वासुदेवाय Translation, Sri Krishna, the personality of Godhead, who is the Paramatma, super soul in everyone's heart, and the benefactor of the truthful devotee, cleanses desire for material enjoyment from the heart of the devotee, who has developed the urge to hear his message, which are in themselves virtuous when properly heard and chanted. Purport by Srila Prabhupada. Messages of the Personality of Godhead, Sri Krishna, are sometimes oh, from messages from the Personality of Godhead Sri Krishna are non different from Him. Whenever, therefore, offenseless hearing and glorification of God are undertaken, this are undertaken, it is to be understood that Lord Krishna is present there in the form of transcendental sound, which is so powerful, or which is as powerful as the Lord Krishna. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu in his Shikshastikam declares that the holy name of the Lord has all the potencies of the Lord and that 
he has endowed his innumerable names with the same potency. Right? Do you know that verse in the Shikshastikam? You don't know the Shikshastikam, so you won't know the verse. Right? So you have to learn the Shikshastikam. Every day we have to recite Shikshastikam prayers. Every morning after Mangalati, we recite the Shikshastikam prayers. And you should know the meaning. You have to know the meaning also of the Shikshastikam prayers. Just like what the second verse, Prabhupada is talking here about the second verse. Nam nam makari bhavadani Jajarva saktis Atra tatra pitani amita smanadena kala Etad si tavakarpa bhagavan mama i Durdaivam idrisham What's the meaning? Who know the meaning? Don't know. Oh my Lord, your holy name alone can render all benediction upon the living being. Therefore you have hundreds and thousands of names such as Krishna, Govinda. In these transcendental names you have invested all of your transcendental energies and there are no hard and fast rules for chanting these holy names. O oh my Lord, you have so kindly made approach to you easy by your holy name. But I am so unfortunate. Why? Why are we so unfortunate? We don't get the taste of holy names. Huh? get the taste of holy Yeah, because we have no attraction for chanting the holy name. This is the problem. We have no attraction to chant the holy name. Although we take initiation and we promise the Guru we will chant every day 16 rounds, but very difficult for most people. We see people sometimes chant, sometimes don't chant. Sometimes Oh, I'm so busy, I have so many things to do, so I cannot chant. So this is unfortunate. We are fortunate because we've come to Krishna consciousness. But then we're unfortunate when we don't chant, if we don't take advantage of the holy name to chant, then we're unfortunate. So we're fortunate souls that we got the mercy, we came to Krishna consciousness. Ramanda Brahmite Kunya Bhakyavanji Guru Krishna Prasadi Pai Bhakti Lata Beach and the Chaitanya Charitamrita Krishna Das Kaviraj describes how the living entity is moving through many different forms of life in different places, different planets, different universes even. And when he's very fortunate, Konya Bhagyavan Ji, when he's very fortunate, when he's a fortunate soul, when Guru Krishna Pasadi Pai Bhukti Lata Beach, he gets the seed of devotion, the Bhukti Lata Beach. Beach, the seed. So the seed of bhakti, which is the bhakti lata, the creeper of devotion, the seed is planted in the heart. And when the seed is planted in the heart, that is coming, that seed, who's giving that seed? That seed is coming from Guru, from the spiritual teacher. Guru Krishna Prasadi Pai. Bhakti Lata Bhij, Prabhupada given, is given the seed for the devotion, to cultivate devotion to Krishna. Prabhupada is given the seed in the heart. And 
we have to water the seed. When you get the seed, you have to water it. If you don't water, then it just simply dries up. Everything dries up. Without rain, then no crops, nothing will be green. But when you get rain, then things grow. The rice grows, the trees grow, the grass grows with rain. But no rain, you just dry up. The seed will not flourish. So very important, we have to water the seed of devotion. We have to water it in our heart. How to water the seed? What are we supposed to do to water the seed? Yes? Chanting. Yes, chanting. Only chanting? What are you going to chant? Hare Krishna Maha Mantra. Okay, Hare Krishna Maha Mantra can chant. What else can you chant? Can chant Bhagavad Gita. Can chant Srimad Bhagavatam. Can chant because it's all about Krishna. Bhagavad Gita is Krishna speaking and Srimad Bhagavatam is all about Krishna. So that's also Kirtan. When we speak from the Srimad Bhagavatam and Bhagavad Gita, recite the slokas, just like you were reciting Shikshastikam, you know the Shikshastikam? Mm -hmm. So we should know the shloka from the Bhagavad Gita and Srimad Bhagavatam, right? How many slokas do you know? Uh, A few. Uh, Some. Two. Two. Uh, two. Uh, oh. Bhagavad Gita. Yeah, which one? Uh, Sarvasya Chaham and Sarvasya Chaham uh, Hidhi Sanyi Vishnu Matakshmitya Vyana Apo Vyana Sarvai Aham Veda Vedyo Vedanda Kit Veda Vit Eva Chaham Karpanya Dosho Pata Swabhavaha Prachami Tvam Dharma Samudha Chedha Yachreya Shal Vishitam Duritan Me Shishatikam sadimam tvam prapannam. Shikshastiham sadimam tvam prapannam. Yes, good. Very good. You know the meaning? Uh, what does it mean? Shikshastiham sadimam tvam prapannam. Shiksha. Who is speaking? Who is speaking that verse? Karpanya dosha opahata swabhava. Who's speaking? Krishna. Huh? Krishna. No. No. Arjuna. Huh? Prabhupada. No. Arjuna. Arjuna. Yeah. Arjuna. It's the Bhagavad Gita, right? Bhagavad Gita is Krishna and Arjuna. Arjuna is speaking. Arjuna is saying, he's saying to Krishna, Shikshastiham sadimam tvam prapanam. He said, I am your disciple. I am your shiksha. I am your student. Please, I surrender to you. Please instruct me. Please instruct me. So Arjuna is asking, Arjuna is saying to Krishna, because I am, I have faults, dosha. I have doshas. Do you have any doshas? Mm. Huh? No? I don't know. Yes. yes. Yeah, we have yeah. doshas, right? Yes. yes. We have doshas, yes. fault. Dosha and faults, right? Yes. They're lazy. Eat too much. Sometimes don't do the work. Lazy. Like that. So, karpanya dosha, pahata, asrabha. Arjuna is asking Krishna. He said, because I am, and because of my weakness, karpan, kripa, kripaya, kripana, karpanya dosopa. There's, there's brahmana and kripana. Brahmana is the generous person. Kripana is the miser. So 
So Arjuna said, I am miser. I have a, a weakness. I'm a miserly. Arjuna is saying, I'm miserly. Because I, I don't know what is my duty. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'm attached to my family. I'm attached to the body. I'm attached to sense gratification. I'm weak. I need somebody to help me to get out of ignorance. I'm confused about my duty. So Arjuna is asking Krishna, you please guide me, please teach me. So Arjuna is surrendering to Krishna. It's a, an important verse. So you, and that's one verse you quoted, right? And the other one was what? Sarvasya Chaham. So who spoke that? Uh, yes, what's he saying? Sarvasya Chaham. I am Krishna saying what? I am where? Where is Krishna? Where is he? In the heart. Yeah. In the heart of who? Of all the people, all the living entities. Yeah, all the living entities. Yeah, it says Paramatma is in the heart of all living entities. And what's he doing there? What's the function of the Paramatma? Watching us. Not just watching. Sarvasya Chaham Ridita Nivisto Matak Smritir Gyanam. Matasmriti gyanam apohanam cha. Matasmriti gyanam. So, what's the super soul doing? Giving three things. Matasmriti remembrance. Gyanam knowledge. And mata to, to allow you to forget. Knowledge, remembrance, and forgetfulness can allow you to remember, can allow you to forget. Forget, I forget I'm a devotee. I forget I'm supposed to chant 16 rounds. I forget I'm supposed to get up and come to Mongo RT. I forget. Right? So I become confused about our duty. So Krishna allows, Krishna in the heart, he he's gives the knowledge to remember. But if we want to forget, Krishna also is, oh, he wants to forget me, okay. Yeah. Krishna allows, he reciprocates. What do you want? Krishna is doing it. Just like here in Srimad Bhagavatam, we're hearing about the super soul. Srinvatam Swakata Krishna. Hearing about Krishna. Hearing the kata of Krishna. Punya Shravana Kirtana. Hearing about Krishna is Punya. It's a pious activity. Right? You want some Punya? Punya yes. Karma? People, what will the Chinese do for Punya? Punya karma, put the fish back in the sea, put the fish back in the sea, let the birds go free. Don't, they were going to eat the bird, they were going to eat the fish, but they put the fish back in the sea and they let the bird go free. Punya karma. <laughs> so, the, what, that's not real punya karma. The, the best punya karma, srinvatam svakata Krishna. Hearing about Krishna, that is the real punya, the real pious activity. You want to get some good luck? You want to get good luck? You have to chant, you have to hear the holy name. You have to hear about Krishna from the Srimad Bhagavatam. You hear regularly and then you get good fortune. 
Srimadam Svakata Krishna Punya Shravana Kirtana Ridi Antastohi Abhadrani 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 Badra means auspicious Subhadra Jagannath Subhadra Balaram So Subhadra Badra is auspicious Subhadra Very auspicious So Abhadra Not auspicious Inauspicious what have ready antas to he abadrani vidunoti suratan removed. You get rid of all the abadras, all the bad things from the heart are removed. Almost all. Almost all. Still a little. But almost all removed. How? By hearing. Simply by hearing about Krishna. But you have to hear. Yet regularly, we don't just hear once a month or once a week, you have to hear every day. You have to make regular program every day to read Srimad Bhagavatam. You see, big book, this is only the first canto, part one. So many pages, you have to read all the books. You have to read regularly. So every day you read for 20 minutes, half an hour, you hear and then you start to learn. But if you don't hear, then no hope, no chance, just only in Maya all the time. So very important for us to hear regularly. He is here. Deity also likes to hear. Krishna is a person. <clears throat> Krishna eats. We offer food to him. He eats. But he doesn't only eat. His business is not just to eat. The deity also likes to hear. And the deity can see. The deity sees who's coming. Who's coming regularly. The deity can see everything what's happening. Krishna knows everything. We have to be very careful, do everything nicely to please Krishna. Okay, any question? No. No? Do you agree? Do you agree with everything? Yes? Not. No? no. You don't agree? If you agree, then you have to surrender to Krishna. Are you ready to surrender? Oh, yes, yes. Really? Oh, good. You come with me. <laughs> Will your mother and father let you go? Yes. Yes. Yes? No problem, huh? No problem. But my school marriage. Oh, forget the school. <laughs> you hear everything from Srimad Bhagavad. Oh, yes. You can learn from Srimad Bhagavad. What you will learn at school? What about you? Um, also studying the same age. Huh? Both of them same age, Maharaj. Yeah. What about you? Are you ready to surrender to Krishna? Yes, sir. Really? Yes. Oh, good. You're finished with school. Yes. No more school, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Just every day chanting Hare Krishna. Okay, Hare Krishna. Thank you very much. Shula Prabhupada. Jai. Go back to Vrindaki. Jai.